All right, what's happening everybody? Look at this. This is a rare occurrence. It actually snowed in Cary, North Carolina last night, like three or four inches. So that happens maybe once a year and it usually doesn't stick. But today it's cold enough that it's stuck. So I've got some snow to play in. Not much, I wish I had more. But I decided to take out the EMX Extreme Bike to try it in the snow. I've ridden in the snow before and it's not easy. It's like riding in sand, but harder. Is it beneficial getting the all wheel drive bike? How much of a difference does that make? All right, we're in single motor mode. I mean, uh, rear wheel drive right now. Which it looks like some people have walked this trail today, which is surprising. Why is there so many people out walking snowy trails? But it's, uh, I mean, this is it's climbing really good. We're going uphill in the snow and ice single wheel drive and it's uh it's handling it easily i don't really feel that unstable here just cruising i don't think we need all wheel drive i'm just killing this these tires have good grip i think they're the what kenda juggernaut pro i like these i don't like the regular kenda juggernauts those tires suck these are good Oh yeah, no issue. Killing it. Let's just switch over to dual motor. Whoa, it's so much more power. It's actually slipperier, I think. Whoa, <laughs> having the front tire spinning like crazy is uh, way harder to steer. Wow, I thought it'd be way easier in all wheel drive. It's kind of harder. Whoa. Gosh, if you really need to dig out of something, maybe. Oh yeah, the single wheel, the single wheel is better for track, or not like stability, steering, really. That's surprising. I thought the all wheel drive would be way, way better. It's not, it's harder to steer because your front wheel is burning out like crazy. Perfect. I'm surprised at that. It just destroyed that trail with ease and just rear wheel drive. Ah, oh, fresh powder. <laughs> oh God. Oh, <laughs> almost, almost. Wow, you can see right there where my front wheel slid out in the mud underneath here. It's, it's uh, yeah, riding in the snow is, is tricky. Let's go all wheel drive. Just do some burnouts in here. Couldn't climb that hill. Let's get a run at it. Oh, there's mud underneath four inches of snow. Oh, is it gonna make it? It's gonna make it. Just digging. Yeah, if you gotta do stuff like that, then you need the all wheel drive, I guess. I don't know if I can do that in, in rear wheel drive. Let's try it. Let's try it rear wheel drive only up this hill. No way, not even close. Yeah, so if you got some really sharp uphills like that, maybe the all wheel drive will help you dig, just dig to the top. Well, let's keep going here. Oh, and I lost it. <laughs> God. Yeah, it's so slippery. It's so much slipperier than sand. Look at that thing. This thing is a beast. This is uh, climbing my list of favorite bikes. This is such a cool little bike. Basically a BMX bike with double motors on it. A crazy battery pack, 28 amp hour or something crazy like that, it's huge. I rode this like 46 miles without pedaling. But I said this before in one of my videos, I mean they just, I feel like Fabulous just kind of gets it. This is a really interesting, cool build that they came up with. A BMX bike with double motors on it and some good components on it and i don't know man i just i'm a big fan of the bikes they're putting out these they have another one coming out that's like a 60 60 volt dual 750 motor crazy bike this thing is gonna be filthy dirty when i'm done 
So what do you think of the EMX Extreme? Is that a bike you'd consider? This is a fun little bike. Okay, here's my complaint though. My back and butt is soaked because this fender does not stop the splash from coming up to the back of the seat. It only comes to here and it needs to come to like here, I guess. So the back of me is soaking wet. But what if I just go through the middle of the woods? No trail. Okay, and we're hopping over trees. Oh. Holy cow. Just digging through. Whoa. We're making our own trail. <laughs> Okay, we made it. Here's the actual trail. Let's just keep going through the woods. Yeah, there's no other bike that's gonna do this. You gotta have all-wheel drive for this part. Whoa. I have not wrecked yet. I haven't fallen yet. I've been pretty cautious. Can we go up this side hill? Let's try it. Get a run at it. Oh man. Yep, we made it. Whew. You get a workout doing this actually. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed this quick snow adventure. I gotta get home because my hands are a little bit cold. So let's, let's hightail it out of here. Burnout.